this shut. Understand? No one can know. You breathe a word about what we did, what happened Christmas, and we're dead. The both of us. You understand? Don't you understand? We're dead. I swear I never meant any of this to happen. And I was never meant to hurt Phil, neither. Well, that's a funny way of not hurting him, innit? Bedding his missus. Me and Sharon. It wasn't... It wasn't what? What? Was some big love affair? Well, it's just a, just a one-off, was it, where you just got unlucky? But don't you understand? Phil Mitchell doesn't care if it was once or a hundred times. You've crossed the line, Keanu. There is a price to pay. It wasn't just a one-off. Me and Sharon, yeah, we were seeing each other. But not when I was seeing Louise. Oh, that makes it all right, then. But we called it off. Because we knew it was wrong. You just couldn't help yourselves. No. Because you was in love. Yes. All right, this is where we had the violins, is it? Could you? Hmm? Could I what? Help yourself. What are you talking about? I've seen the two of you together. Could you help falling in love with Stacy? <sighs> Martin. Shut up. What are you doing, Martin? Hey, shut up! <laughs> This ain't you. None of this. Phil? I ain't stupid. I know what he's capable of. I've already told you. Phil don't even know where you are. This is Ben's doing. And he's even worse. But you? What? What, I'm not a real man? Is that what you're saying? No. Not like them? You're not a killer! You know nothing about me. You're a dad, Martin. We both are. Well, you're a dead man anyway. Or oh, don't you get that? It doesn't matter who pulls this trigger. There is no way you're walking out of it. They'll make sure of it. No, you're making sure of it. Yeah. But it's nothing personal. <laughs> Look, some things have happened to me the last few months. I never fall. And this is my way out. This is the slate wiped clean. What by doing the Mitchell's dirty work? For I've them? already told you someone's going to. You know, this, if this is about money. It ain't. What then? This. This is about keeping my family safe. I've told you, I have to. You don't have to do anything. There's no one else here. It's just me and you. Please, Martin, think of her. Think of Peggy.
for Bex. I told you! There's no choice. What are you doing here anyway? So, you take care of Keanu while the Mitchells put their feet up at home? Go to the Vic's, more like the plan. Way everyone can see that their hands are squeaky clean. So why not go to the police? That way their hands won't be squeaky clean then. And say what? There's nothing to tie them into any of this. There's you. Where's the proof of that? It's just gonna be my word against theirs. Look, I am in enough trouble as it is. Shop the Mitchells, I might as well dig my own grave right now. So I'll tell you, why don't I? Well, I'll go get Louise. You're dead to her! Why can't you get that through your stupid head? There's got to be a way out of this. There was. Who is it? It's Ben. What's he saying? Never work. Why not? Linda! Fit young fella like you. So long as you don't actually take a bullet to the head, you'll survive. Can you actually hear yourself? You take one in the shoulder, it's still gonna be a hell of a lot of blood. So we hurt him, but, but not too much. Well, it wouldn't be the first time. He survived that all right. Keanu, this is crazy. Fine. So what's your way out? One shot. And then we get you to a hospital. No name. Hopefully, as far as they're concerned. You're just another casualty to get patched up and packed off out again. There, I reckon. One shot in there. Now, a bullet hole in the shoulder is not going to look the same as one in his head. The amount of blood there'll be, there'll be no way of telling exactly where he was shot. And, and we could smear some of it over your head as well. Well, there's some booze in the, in the back of the van that'll help with the pain. It's still not going to fall, Phil and Ben. It will if they hear him begging you not to do it, and then they hear the shot. Linda. We ain't got time to stand around talking about this. Well, it ain't going to work. Just do it. No. Do it! No! What? Nothing. You said hit him in the shoulder. I did. No. Oh. Give me that cloth. What? Martin! Oh. You gotta get up. Keanu, get up and start start begging. All right, do you hear me? Beg for your life! 
Help me, Martin. Come on. Mm. Get him up. Get him up. Sit him up there. That's it. That's it. All right, listen. Listen. When the gun goes off, right, you fall back on the floor. Right, turn your phone on. Wait, wait. Ready? Please. I'm begging you. For the sake of my baby. is growing. Get a bit lively, did it? Please. I'm begging you. For the sake of my baby. You really did it. The gun's disposed of. Now you sort my problem. And I'm keeping this until you do. So where is he? That's better you don't know. I'm serious. That's your proof, isn't it? <laughs> now, you and Heather He was just a stupid kid. He never meant for that to happen. He just did. What happened today? That was anything but. <laughs> 